at ringside uh, immediately preceding his match. I have a single question for Mr. Sullivan. Only four days remaining on Dusty Rhodes. You don't have to remind me about the four days. I know. I've counted them down. Let me tell you this. I've never been scared a day in my life. Okay, I don't know how he did it. There was a bounty on his head. He put a mask on. He lasted. I know what he's intended to do. Four days left. I'm not scared. I don't want anybody to believe that I'm scared. Because in my heart, I know when he comes back, one-on-one, -on -one, someday, Rhodes, Someday soon, it will be me and you, and someday someone's going to have to pay hell, and it ain't going to be me. All right, the comments from uh, a very irritated, a very agitated uh, Kevin Sullivan, and I am not sure that uh, they're even going to wait for introductions here, but in case they are, let's turn it over to our ring announcer. Ladies and gentlemen, this event, one fall with a 20-minute time limit. Introducing first from Pampa, Texas, Weighing in at 285 pounds, Cowboy Ron Van. His opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, at 230 pounds, Kevin Sullivan. Kevin Sullivan moving out against uh, Ron Bass. One fall, 20 minute time limit, and it's Bass with that uh, broken hand, but he's uh, using that uh, cast rather effectively right now. Bass, of course, we've had quite a string of injuries. Uh, buddy with uh, uh, Barry Windham uh, coming back after a concussion. Now Mike Graham is out, uh, injured by Roddy Piper. And Ron Bass, of course, with his broken hand. That's right. It seems like wrestling has been getting completely out of hand here, Gordon. There's been so many injuries here. Uh, Ron Bass at least can function properly with his, uh, this plaster cast on his hand. But then Barry Windham is out. Now Mike Graham is out. And right now it seems like uh, Kevin Sullivan is in a lot of trouble. You know, when you had Kevin over here for the interview, it sounds like he is awfully worried that Dusty Rhodes, four days, four more days, Dusty Rhodes can come back and face him man on man. And his contention is right now from Kevin Sullivan that Dusty's hiding behind a mask, but Dusty is the kind of man that does not have to hide from anyone, Gordon. Well, that's a matter of fact. Barry Windham, of course, back in action at 110%. And it is Ron Bass, but of course, it's not unusual. Uh, in the Super Bowl and any uh, pro football game, you're going to find uh, one of the players with a cast on somewhere. And uh, Bass is no exception to the rule here tonight uh, uh, in this wrestling match against Kevin Sullivan. Sullivan, of course, out of uh, Boston, uh, Massachusetts. Bass uh, out of Pampas, Texas. Well, you know, with a uh, cast on your wrist or on an ankle or something like that, uh, the cast does give you almost absolute protection. In fact, Sometimes the cast can even be used as a weapon. It's uh, rock hard. It's very solid. Uh, you can, if you beat a man upside the head with a cast, I think the head will give in before the cast does. So it gives you good protection on there. And uh, look right, right now, Ron Bass does have Kevin in a lot of a uh, lot of pain, a lot of trouble right now. As a single arm bar now on uh, Kevin Sullivan as they go across to the far side of the ring. We are located, by the way, uh, directly at ringside, and. Uh, Our cameraman, of course, we've been on a, uh, an elongated tour uh, around the country, pausing here in uh, the great cigar city in Bass, taking a lot of punishment to the side of the head, the flat of the foot of Kevin Sullivan, flashed out repeatedly to the side of the head and ear of Ron Bass Sullivan. But as he came off the ropes, it was Bass connecting very solidly. And I would say that Bass is staying a bit ahead of Sullivan in this match so far. Well, if this was going to be judged on points, uh, Gordon certainly would be uh, Ron Bass. But uh, let's not ever underestimate Kevin Sullivan. Kevin Sullivan is very wily and tricky. But right now, it's, it's absolutely Ron Bass has the upper hand. Uh, if Ron don't turn his back on him, he stays right on top of him. He's got Kevin on the run right now. The people are, the crowd's going wild now. Bass catching him with a good forearm to the side of the head. Sullivan misses with a hard right hand. And you can hear the appreciation of the crowd here. And it is a jam-packed crowd of over well, thousands and thousands of people here in the building. And it is uh, Kevin Sullivan directly over our broadcast table. And Bass brings him up. There's that uh, power. Zone. Wait a second. Angelo Mosca just hit the ring. Mosca just hit the ring. The referee calls for the bell. Bass using that pass very effectively. And Mosca ducking away from Bass. Bass is trying to get him cornered. And it moves. The, 
there. There's Kevin with a chair in the ring. The, they're going wild. They're going to need some help here. Something's going to happen. It is uh, Kevin Sullivan smashing away with that chair on the uh, cast in the hand of Cowboy Ron Bass, and they're trying to rip that. Uh, they're trying to rip that cast off, and it is Bass driven outside the ring, right next to our broadcast table. Bass down on the canvas. Bass rather down on the floor, and uh, he has got to have re-injured that hand. There's no question about it. He's got to re-injure that hand. He's being attended to right now, and it was uh, it was uh, Kevin Sullivan obviously disqualified for outside interference, and uh, they are attending to Ron Bass, and we'll be back. We'll be back. <laughs> 